Sisters and liches aren't always fun. He took my life, and she got my gun. My lich here is stupid, my sister, she's dumb. But having a threesome has always been fun. <laughs> Gonna slip you an oogie. Make you real green around the gills. Just you see. Oh, what a bitch. And I, okay, I won't sing anymore. Hi, I'm Team Kills, and what I like to do is make gaming easier. And welcome to the Sister Lich Mayhem, or Sister Lich Threesome. That one sounds better. I'm just gonna tell you how to do it. And unfortunately, it's not gonna be the best news. Now, first of all, if you wanna get two sisters or two liches or a sister lich combination to attack whatever you're hunting the first thing you need to do is bad news railjack yep you're gonna have to level up this section all the way to this level first what that's gonna allow you to do is one of your crew members are gonna be your on-call member what the on-call guy can do is you call him and he's gonna hang out for three minutes like all the other specters he's gonna be the same level or a good enough level with the enemies and then they hang out for three minutes after that they disappear they go I guess back to the ship and then after 10 minutes you can call them back when you call them back they're gonna be a higher level they're never gonna be weak they're just like the other specters really really good this level will allow you to bring your sister or lich whichever one you enslaved as your on-call crew member now the second step to getting this done is more bad news, you gotta die. I was in the area, heard the screams, and thought, I'll just bet that's my little darling. And here you are. Yeah, if you die a couple times, they're almost guaranteed to show up. They technically will show up in uh, levels with enemies level 35 and up. Or if you're having a problem. So if your lich or sister, whatever you're hunting, shows up and you have a warframe like Korra or Sephika that can tie them up. The computer's going to think you're struggling because you haven't taken too long to kill them. They're going to come and help. So frames like Loki or Ivira, you can just go invisible and wait until you get some backup. Once your backup arrives, then you call your on-call backup, and then you just watch the fun. Speaking of fun, that's all this really is. This isn't a sound game plan, like it's a good idea to enslave a sister or lich, but it's really about the weapon. You don't want to enslave a sister with the Detron, that, that would be useless. You want something like the Tenant Envoy, or the Ark of Plasmor. And as far as the Kuva, mm, I have two perfect Kuvas. Um, one has the Chakor, the eraser gun. And the other one has the Kuva Tonkor, that is the status rainbow murder ball machine. After that, I stopped enslaving liches. But when you get your favorite lich or sister or weapon, you call them out and have fun. Sometimes I just call all the specters out. There's no rules to this at all. Like I said, this is just fun. Now on that note, I hope you have fun, I hope you like the video, I hope it helps, I hope you join the team, it's a lot of hope, of killers, become a killer of teams, let me know what you're thinking in the comments, it's the only way we can talk, make sure you keep it easy in life, and remember, just keep gaming. <laughs>